Hey, Mitch the RV guy here with Mr. Motorhome bringing you something that's just about completely brand new. This is a Skyline. It is their Koala series. State-of-the-art construction. It actually has Asdale walls, so you don't gotta worry about dry rot or molding inside your walls like you do on other fiberglass trailers. This has a great layout at 26 feet. Let me start out by showing you the inside. The layout on this is fantastic, but the real story is the construction. Everything on here is light. For example, you see the paneling here for the cabinetry. This wood is 50% lighter than the other wood that manufacturers use for the cabinetry paneling. Same thing for your countertops. Same thing for the floors and the walls as well. As opposed to being Luon, the walls are Asdale walls. Oh man, if you hate leaks, if you hate your trailers going to crud on you and you hate something really heavy, you'll want a Koala. It's state of the art. You've got your giant Dometic refrigerator freezer. Everybody likes being able to bring food with them. You know I do big pantry and look at how wide that pantry is it's very very usable keep in mind this is about 5,000 pounds that's the special construction nice dinette turns into a sleeper in minutes and look at that oh beautiful glass inlay and if you could feel just how light this is it's unbelievable even just opening the cabinets up feels like a breeze nice entertainment center here it's even got room for a slightly bigger TV if you want couch that folds out into a bed the opposing, or the slide out over here, opposing the dinette gives you a nice conversation area, which is fantastic. And the kitchen for a 26 foot, 5,000 pound trailer, just about brand new, gives you a lot of counter space. A microwave and an oven, not just an, uh, a microwave or a convection microwave like a lot of them give you. And look, additional storage space, not just veneer storage. That's a deep usable storage space that you can put a lot of useful stuff in. You even got a little hook here for your keys, which you can't beat that at all. Now, Skyline's been building these since 1962. This is a company, well, they're not brand new, trying to figure out how to do it. Jimbo's not saying, well, you know, I've been fixing up tractors for the last five years. How's about you get there with my cousin that's a welder who got laid off, and we'll make some of them their travel trailers. Heck no, this thing's got the quality. Not only that, but the Asdale walls, you could literally take an Asdale wall in put it in a lake and come back six months later and you're still going to be fine. That's where the construction's going, guys, and that's what you got here. Oh, huge living area, lots of storage space, even the lights are really nice. Now let's go ahead and jump to the outside and I'll talk to you more about this really cool koala. So let's start out with the basics. You get to a campground, what's the first thing you got to do? Unhook your trailer. Well, you got two options. You can either go uh, and crank or like this skyline, you just hit the button comes up and down got a little light so you don't have to take the lighter out and try and see where you're going of course the graphics are in fantastic shape it's a 2013 this is a lumilux fiberglass lumilux fiberglass does not fade nearly as much as most fiberglass does not to mention remember i was telling you about the aluminum uh about the asdale walls oh, look at that aluminum construction you see the welds that's so much better than the ones that are just interlocked this wall right here is the type of wall that can last you 20 years on a travel trailer the wood particle grain that you have on most of the fiberglass travel trailers it's bonded to just is not a 20 year product folks. It's, it's a mahogany product that's basically particle board that's been put together. It's called Luon. This is far, far better constructed. Asdale composite on board is something you want to see. Not to mention, look at this, 5,150 pounds for this 26 foot travel trailer with a slide with power awning, outside speakers. This is truly a Mr. Motorhome travel trailer. It's an almost completely brand new shape. It is just gorgeous. Of course, we've been selling motorhomes for 37 years. We sell only pre-owned stuff. The whole time we've had an A plus Better Business Bureau rating. You can't go wrong doing business with the most trustworthy guy in the block. Look at how the roof is slightly crowned so water falls off of there. It's really cool. Not to mention the fact that this roof composite that they have, the TPO, it's not like the rubberized roofs that a lot of them use that are cheap. That has a plastic base, which makes it so you don't have those black streaks running down. Look at the slide out. Not all slide outs are made the same. I'm telling you, you see these right here, this trek at the top and the bottom on both sides. There's a four point rack and pinion system that brings these slides in on the koalas. It makes it impossible for them to come in sideways. The other type of slide out systems, well, they just might leave you stranded. You're going to be out there trying to push in while she's like, I am holding down the button. That doesn't leave for uh, very many good camping memories. Oh, a sewer flush. You don't ever, ever have to put one of those wands down your black tank again and take it out where it's all covered in poop. And Raised in a group of poop, oops, no fun. 
and of course you've got the outside shower so that if you do happen to step in a cow patty you can get that sucker off before going in your koala now keep in mind that even though this thing's so light that a trained husky sled team could get it down the road at Mr. Motorhome, we're about to set you up with the best experience you've ever had. Make sure your truck's good to go. We've got a huge parts department, service department that's second to none. In our consignment program, frankly, if we were to release the secret of our consignment program to the Chinese, I think that they would overtake us in GDP within the first year. Hey, Mitch the RV guy, hoping to see you here in Elk Grove real soon.